okay um i'm gonna have a little attempt you know we're putting a temporary shower in um into what's going to be an ensuite because the camper van i've got to go back um it's only allowed to be up here six months so that's got to go back so we got no means of washing basically and not water so i'm gonna rig a cheap old uh electric shower up which i had at home not working anyway so the plan is in this room let's just see if i can go back so obviously it makes makeshift kitchen at the moment but this is going to be the the main bedroom and it is something like five and a half meters by three and a half or four meters wide so it's a fair size but the plan is that's a 120 shower base so that's going to be the width of the ensuite there's going to be a stud partition here going right away across to that wall and obviously straight across and up this wall okay right way across there'll be a door around about by here going into a walking wardrobe there will be a door around about by there just in front of the toilet which will come into the ensuite toilet's already in as you can see connected to the one next door in the previous video just for there we'll have a little um, little sink and then our petition about six inches in from there six inches in from there and I have a, a pivot door um, I've measured this up now underneath but that waste is not going to hit any of the concrete lintels as it's just going to be going through one of them clay blocks and then matching in with the waste up below now my plan is with these walls Back home, I'd be putting roofing battens on these, filling with 25 mil um, Kingspan insulation, and then plasterboarding. So that's my plan there. So this will be, oops, not that far. Probably something like that from the wall. There will be a petition through here, where the pipe work will come up, eventually the shower. Um, yeah, and that's it. So basically I'm going to put the shower on the wall here, bring some water up to it, and run electric to it, and just put a makeshift curtain around you for when we're out in February and April, um, so we can shower. Probably the next job when I do come out, we'll be petitioning it all off, uh, and finishing the job basically. I'm getting it much better. But uh, the electric shower is going to stay for a while, because I have no idea what I'm going to do yet for hot water because we want it off grid solar panels and we are possibly a good year or more away from installing something like that so this is just going to be a temporary measure electric off grid which we can shower um, so yeah I hope that explains it 10 for all okay so I'm just about to put the shower on the wall what I've noticed uh, with the walls out here, hey, the clay blocks and um, the clay blocks are hollow. So it's a nightmare to get a good fixing in there. So you drill your hole and try to get a bigger plug and a nice fat screw to get in it just so it expands and it, it gets a good bite. But it has been a bit of a nightmare. There we go, that plug is just spinning in there. Plug's gone straight through. Let's try and find another plug. Awesome. 
That's all good. <coughs> so, where is that metal thing? It's gone. Okay, well, we're going to do there. Uh, bought one of these to fit on there to come out, which will then attach to these. Now, these are the, this is the 22 mil or 20 mil irrigation pipe we've been using out here, um, which is all twist fit. You don't need that special heat machine. Um, and I don't know if you can see in there, but that's threaded. And that one will go into there. Like so. That will go onto there. And then we're going to bring the water up through as a temporary measure and bang them onto that. Which will fit in there. So we've got the water. And then I've just got to rig some electric up to get the electric in here. So we'll have a bit of PDF tape. I don't know if you can hear that rain out there, but uh, Martin's still out in it, I think. The joys of being a bricklayer, eh? I feel so guilty being, being inside all nice and warm. Get a spanner. I'm just tightening this one up because I did loosen this yesterday just to move it to see if we had some movability here. Right. Is that wet, Matt? Here's Mark now. Wet, I was just telling him now, I said he's still out there in us. Ah. I just put that egg on. Well, you picked that up on your own? It is, is it? Ah, right. Right, right on it. I can't even squeeze anything. Sorry. So keep it as what our original plan out there, then, is yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, thanks up there. Hmm. No, it's not cold. Ah, it's not cold, is it? It's just bloody. It's just a damp feeling in the air all the time, isn't it? I do, I'd, I'd feel lousy by it. Just, yeah, yeah boiling, yeah. but I feel lousy. Damp, like. Uh, no, I'm alright. I just gotta remember now which is the new one. We had two of these. Well, one already here, which was leaking on the toilet, so we bought a new one yesterday. But I've mixed them up. I think it's gotta be that one. Oh, it's all that's buckled up in there. I probably had it somewhere. <laughs> I think it might be dinner time now in a minute. What are we having for dinner today, Matt? Pot noodle, boy. Pot noodle, is it? Nice 
speciality, but... Chicken curry? Digestive's on the plate. I got chicken curry there, mind. Yeah, do you think we could find some ready meals last night? Yeah, let's have to try that. It's mad all that, how much that goes in. I put PDF on it. No, because that's what we done last time, didn't we? Right, that's that. Ready to bring a water pipe up in now, really, Mark. Electrics will go in here and it comes through, yeah? And I'll just pin it across the wall and down through there. Like. And i got to find that silver thing for that. Let's have a look for some bits. Well, we just put this video on now, and as you can see, no sound on it whatsoever. So I don't know what have happened on this video. Maybe the mic's turned itself off. I'm not sure, I ran out of battery. But anyway, so we're ready to put the shower tray down. It's going to be the permanent shower tray, but only put it in temporary. So all you can see there now, we have placed it down. We've worked out where um, the drainage all is going to go. That's uh, the piece which screws to the bottom of the uh, shower tray. Um, so we've kind of like drawn around it. Um, given us uh, maybe a, an inch leeway um, we're going to drill that out now shortly knock it down through um, let's just wait until that comes on i have no idea what i was talking about or what i'm trying to tell you there this is just from memory but as you'll see now in a minute martin drills down through and because we want the uh, shower tray to be able to move a about a little bit um, because we're not sure exactly where that shower tray is going. I know is when I worked it out for the stud petitioning uh, for the ensuite, is roughly in the right direction. So I think I tell Martin now to drill the holes, go around on the outside, make that 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 shape bigger than what it actually is. So um, there he goes. He starts drilling down through. We've made sure from the underneath as well that there's not a, a concrete beam in the way. Um, and yeah, it's just straight down the route. You can see it's probably 50 mil of, of a screed, and then it goes into the hollow clay blocks. Um, so we'll just knock that out, drill it all, knock it out. And I'll see you on the next video now. Perhaps the sound's working now. This is where you know we need to perhaps try a clamp. Watch out, all the way, mate. Okay, so we've connected that. PTF tape, flexi. Into the, the fancy doodah, whatever that is. Reducer, uh, back to the 20 mil irrigation pipe, which is going down through there. And that's gonna link into where it went up for the toilet. Well, I'm gonna finish that. I'm gonna knock that through. All right. So, I thought I'd knock a bit off for there. Just give us a bit more. Um, I'm not saying we need it, but you never know. No, we can always get it from it from the underneath anyway, can't we? Yeah. Yeah, now we've got that bit there. So yeah. that's that. I've noticed for this as well because this is obviously going to be temporary I don't know how I would fix that normally maybe you could put uh, expandable foam underneath it but if you stand on that now it's bouncy so you need something underneath it so that's going to be laid on possibly a bed of cement expandable foam but I can't do any of that now because this is in your know, temporary and it will be taken back out for me to do the stud petition work so I'm going to find maybe some ply board cut some ply She'll fit in there just to take the bounce out of it when we stand on it. And that's how I make, well, if you lay that down there now, I'll go looking for some play and I'll set this up. We'll show you do the waste and I'll find play for this. Cut some play down. No problem. Yeah. No problem. Yeah, we'll put the waste in first, shouldn't we? That'll yeah, you can put that on there now, is it? Yeah, that'll be the best bit. Yeah, I know. Actually. Or anything. Uh, we 
paper on. Shall I clear the table off and put it on the table? Or? Need it overhanging a bit, like, but yeah, be perfect when next we've got your hand, get your hand underneath there. Paper that like yeah, that. I'll just hold it off. Right. I'm going to turn that towards us. So that's, where's the other bits? That is in order, as it was on there. Right, okay. I haven't separated it at all. It's a bit further there, that. Yeah, no. Oh, no, no. no I'll pass that to me, I'll put it there now. There's a big screw in there. Oh, you've got the big screw. So far. I don't know. Is that for the bloody... Pull that bit. Um... <laughs> oh, that? that's where you're going, isn't Yeah. Is that what's going here? Possibly. That's a temporary thing. Well, that's, isn't it? That's it now, isn't it? Yeah. It's got to be that. Right. Gotta be. Small. Doesn't go inside the grey pipe. Yeah, uh, this is the two. Now, which way would you say it goes in? Looks the same all the way around, doesn't it? This looks chamfer to me, if you there. Yes, it is. Right, so that way, then, that way in there. This then pushes up to it. Yeah. And then keep that blue one on end there. Because no water was coming out. Okay. So now it goes up to that. Ah, where did that go? And then that goes in there, as I added. Right, yeah, that's what it that looks like then. I'm not going to bother still look on in it then. That's cross right I think it will last straight away. This is all going to come back out. Yeah. So if we have a little trip, it doesn't matter, does it? Because it's only going out the bare ground underneath. Did they come with any... Destructions. That's what I had. One on bottom, one on top. That's like that. Then. Is that sitting over there, tidy? Yeah. Hmm. Ish. Now it is. That's better. Okay. Pile that there then. Get a screw going. Seems to be at the nine door, eh? Oh. <laughs> I don't know, I think there's a flat one on here. Make sure he's uh... no. Let me just tighten that a minute. That seems to go in nice then. Um... Well, 
Oh, that looks good, doesn't it? That looks good, doesn't it? Just... Do you want me to loosen it a bit? Yeah, slightly as well. That's it, that's it. Have a look. Yeah. I ain't gonna over tighten it, just. No, yet. no. It's... That's fine, it's not it's up, it's up in there, but it's tidy. Yeah, well, when I'll do our now properly, it'll be silicone. And like you said, at the moment, if it drips, it does not matter. No. Just a temporary shower. Right, measure. I want to play around about 45 by a metre. About five, I think, but let me get that off. I'll go yeah. Okay, so these are some offcuts of wood, just under 25 mil. These are roughly the same, 25 mil. So what I'm gonna do, I'll place a batten up here. Um, oh, I tell you what, I've just noticed, Mark. Obviously it's thinner down here because of the full. So we've got a 25 mil here. Yeah. But by there it could be 10 mil. So if I run these kind of like, like that, just yeah. stick them on with a blob of silicone for now because I want to rip them off at a later date and fill full of fixer foam. Um, and do it like that, really, isn't it? One, two, maybe. I know we can get rid of one there, one there. Can and I'll get, find some thinner that, bits of wood there. Can we get that sheet in the middle? I don't know. That'd be the one, wouldn't it? Ideally, we we'll keep want. that in. Eh? I like that. I'd have to put a straight edge. Yeah, it'd end. Look. No, I don't have an idea. No, it's going to be too thick. So, we'll use a couple of them. I'll put one, two, a little bit by there, a little bit by there. I'll find some smaller wood. Go down the bottom. Uh, and yeah. just, just stick it here and there so we end bouncing. Put a flat edge, or straight edge on that point, that point, yeah. and that'll give us the thing. So we're just going to do that. Dead pull. <laughs> Thought we had it, but we didn't. <laughs> right, so a couple more thinner bits, which is there. <coughs> I tell you what we could do with Mark. Do you want to go and get that level? Oh, yeah. oh no, hang on, I got a. Straight edge, in here. Save us from going out. I'm on a road again. What is this? That's just silicone, so that'll do. Yeah. That's right, they haven't gone off. <laughs> Must have missed this stuff now. Huh? How long is that? Oh my god, a straight edge. Yeah, that's perfect there, then, you know. I'll just glue that one in. Yep. I'm not putting much of this on guys because this is just temporary and we want it to come off nice and easy at a later date. Alright, right, is that alright? Yep. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I didn't, it's gone off in there. Uh, so I'll take it back up. Good. Just check that if I can get away with that or no. 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 So the are too thick now. Let me just get that. That's the next thickest one. Try that one, Mark. Maybe just put it there. 
That's yeah, good there, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, hang on. Middle is a bit there. Bit A or? Bit A in the middle, yeah. Well, look now. Same. Just look. Is it right? good or not? That seems it's, good. It's up off here, that's the only pushing I don't. I think it'll get away with that, though. Try it below that. Yeah? Yeah, so I got it. That's what I should be thinking. Yeah. Yeah. Good day. Been doing a bit this in. That's in there. Yeah. Yeah. Well, actually, if this is quite a good job of this, this can stay in here. And I still just put expandable just foam. Expandable foam, now. Alright, I'd like to have something in there now. Because I reckon I can dip there. That's good. That's good. Let <coughs> me find a bit more. Then a bit so to go down in here. And I think we could do something down here maybe. Or oh, there's a little one there and a little one here or something. Is that the thicker end? No. Yes. That's where we'd have to taper it off like. Take a piece of silicon mm. on there, see? Yeah, yeah. Where's that straight there, Joe? They're fine, just put some. Just put a, a bigger blob on yeah, it. Yeah, like bigger that. blob on This one's well, tightish by you, but. Do you want to move that down a bit? What's about that now? Yeah. yeah, that's good. I'll put that on top and then push down. Yep. That's it. Perfect. Move them across by there. That's it. Alright, other side. This one will be alright. I'll see if I can find a bigger one for that now. The thicker piece up there, I. Right? <laughs> little time to set. Should we, before we put that in a minute, give our time just to go off a sec? Should we connect the water? Hold what do we need? Uh, I'm going to turn it off a minute. Yeah. Just open the lem. Um, turn the tap on when I say I've got a cut out in my pocket. Sorry, I didn't do it downstairs. So, yeah, we're just going to. Uh, well, that's set. For five ten minutes we're going to go downstairs connect the water up uh, which means we've got to put a tea on it and then that's done let that set place that down we ain't going to glue this down at all though 
I've glued them so it will it could move. I might put a bit of batten on the outer side, which I'll screw to the floor, something to hold it in place temporary. Um, but I don't want to glue this at all because ripping this up, I could break this when we need to put it in properly. So, um, got the cutters. I think that's all we need downstairs. Let's go and have a look then. Like that, right, you know, guys. Raining pouring. Raining pouring. Okay, doggy. So we've got to get up in there, haven't we? Tea. Yeah, it's a tea. Water's off now, though, yeah? Water's off. Just got a bit. I've got a cut this in my hand. <laughs> On the road again. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't need tea. Let's see if we can show you this. What's that tea? <laughs> okay, let's have a torch. I don't know what I have got up there, Mark. Enough bowl is an head light. I was just going to ask you what one of them. Yeah, I've got a <laughs> cup, couple out there. Yeah. Okay, so there's the elbow, guys, which goes up into their um, toilet. We're now going to put a tea on there, so I'll stay exactly the same, kind of. That goes up. And then we're going to cut this, link that into that, and that is it, it's done. Huh? We basically got a shower then. Just gotta sort the electrics out. Right, I reckon, Mark, if you come up in by here and sit there, you can be cameraman and okay. I'll start taking this apart. I yeah. can do that kind of thing. Oh, I've not got a GoPro with the light on. No, I got it's bloody everything tight. else. Oh, it's gonna be tight as hell now, isn't it? We should have some water come up here as well, shouldn't we? Yeah. I'm back and stay on there, yeah. can't I? Keep all the bits on yeah, there. There should be a rubber now in there. Yeah, I've got the rubber. Well, no, I've no, got the rubber. the rubber. The rubber's inside of that. This is where we're going to have fun now, doing these two bits here. Got the rubber. Don't move that rubber. Right, rubber's on. That's that out of the way. <clears throat> right. Have a look at this one, Paul, because it's, it's a different. Oh, then different make, is it? It's a different one, yeah. Just, just have a look, make sure we're. Oh. Did something fall? Yeah, rubber. I had that. Yeah, it is a different make, isn't it? Yeah. Rubber up first, yeah. Oh. 
I mean, yeah. disconnect that bloody pipe. Well, this one. <laughs> yeah. I don't hear any problem. I, I got a funny feeling this would have worked with the other one. It was just spinning. I got it now because you know that black thing you put up on it? Yeah. That's stiff. Yeah. So it won't One pull it down. down. Yeah. But it drags it down as soon as you've got it started up. Which I have now. Okay, that one's on. So all they're doing is in there now, isn't it? Gone in a bit. I think it's right. I think. I'm going to take them. Are we tight upstairs? Train? Yeah. <laughs> but it, the shower could be on, though, could it? I'm not sure. We'll go up to the shower. Fill the tank and we won't come on until the tune wrong, will it? Yeah. And that should be turned off, so that should be Well, this is going to pack you under. I'm over there. Round two. Don't take our pipe off. You might have to, but just to get in there. Um, we can't take it off. Where's it jointed to? Uh, right behind you and by here. That rubber? Uh, Is it that rubber, do you think? I don't know. Oh, yeah, we've got different rubber in there, haven't we? Yeah. Right, 
Um, yeah, that's what you're going to get now. Definitely thicker, this rubber. Oh, pipes. I'll do it later on, bud. Yeah, so by you, you need about uh, three sets of hands because I had to try to pull the pipe as hard in as I could, push the other end together and screw it up at the same time. Obviously Martin was on the camera and taught, so it was a nightmare, so we kept on having leaks. Well, well, how cross I did? Mm -hmm. Top and bottom up. Fingers crossed it works this time. Is that be like new it's only then? Yeah, fine. All good. Turn four. Use the right washer. Put a, put up a washer and don't drop that. That is the secret. Yeah, that's fine. So eventually we got there in the end. Uh, wrong washer out of a different make T, but uh, all working. Shower installed, um, and it works. So we've job done. Thanks for watching.